welcome to Michael's World. Today, I'm gonna to be sharing with you something really big and really cool. In three, two, one. It's a solar balloon that's 50 feet long. It's almost as long as an 18 wheeler. And I'm really excited because we're gonna take this solar balloon really high in the sky. Let's get started. Whoa, there's 400 feet of string too? That means we can make it go really high. Let's open it. This is really big. Oh my gosh. I don't know how I'm gonna fill this thing up with air, but I guess I'll try. In three, two, one. to the grass. There's a little more space down here. Let's flatten this out a little first before we um, get the air in. I'm gonna let my dad run with it. There we go. Do my method. <laughs> he has the longest hair in the world. My dad's tying the end off right now. This should help trap more of the air. We'll get even more air in this. Because we realize the other end is also open. Yeah, I thought so, one was tied off. So, the, so that's why it wasn't filling up very fast. Because the other end was letting the air out. Whoa, look at that. Perfect. All right, I think we have enough air in there. Tying off the other end. Looks like we split the other end. We got a few splits in it. Uh-oh. Oh, it's no. It's a very thin plastic. We have to do I have to. Plastic. I'm going to go through. Oh, no. Uh-oh. There's holes in it. Well, we're just going to have to make it a little shorter. I'll tie it off right here. Good thing this thing is 50 feet long. Yeah. Spare a few extra feet. Still at least um, 46 feet long, probably. Sure. Okay. Now we'll just wait and see how fast it takes for all this air inside to heat up. The yeah. air molecules heat up, they're going to expand and bombard each other. To the point where the air inside here is hotter than the air on the outside, it's going to cause it to rise. Let's stretch it out. Well, it's definitely filling up. Well, it's definitely off the ground a little. Gonna maybe give it a little more length on the string. Hopefully there's not too many holes causing it not to go up. I'm gonna send a wave down to you, Michael. Ready, go! Whoa, you see that? Whoa! Making some S waves and some P waves. This one's called a compression wave. When Michael does that, there we go presses and then it goes all the way back down. Okay, ready? Whoa. 
There's a lot of really tiny holes here. Yep. So we're gonna have to tape it up so yeah, they won't let out any more air than it already has. This will hopefully help us take flight. Well, it's not exactly taking flight like we wanted. I think we had to do one too many patches there, there, a few down there. So we're gonna take it up to the pool rock and see how we can get some air up there. We probably should have taken it to the park so we wouldn't be running into trees and scratching it up. There we go. <laughs> yeah, be careful. Oh. Getting all wrapped up, huh? Yeah, Here he goes again. Oh! Slowly making its way over. Careful. Uh-oh, it's in the water now. Oh no, it's getting twisted up and getting weighed down. This could be the end of it. <laughs> 